Last night, a gathering was held at the Kotel, the Western Wall, to remember the Jewish communities of Gush Katif, Jewish Gaza, and their destruction. On the 8th of Elul, Jews gathered in the Kotel, the Western Wall. The event was to pray for the rebuilding of the destroyed communities of Gush Katif. We are in the Western Wall Plaza in Jerusalem, the place of our destroyed temple. We are mourning the destruction of Gush Katif. Today, the 8th of Elul, the IDF gave the land of Israel to our enemies. We are crying over the destruction of our temple and also Gush Katif. We are in the days of mercy and forgiveness. We are in Jerusalem. We ask God that we will get back our heritage. This is a terrible disaster. We remember the burning of the synagogues and the desecration of God's name. While the main focus of the prayer rally was Jewish Gaza, the overarching tragedy of the destruction of the two temples was not forgotten. A week ago, I met a rabbi. I asked him, where does he live? He said, There is an abomination. Our synagogues have been burnt in fire. Can we not cry? Despite the destruction of Gush Katif, optimism remains that the communities will be rebuilt. We came to pray and say slichot. Some are also fasting. We look forward to the redemption and to the rebuilding of Gush Katif. Rav Shmuel Eliyahu, chief rabbi of the city of Tzfat, and son to Rishon Letzion Rav Mordechai Eliyahu, closed with a passage from the Tanakh mourning the destruction of the temple. For this our heart is broken, our eyes darkened, and foxes roam through Hartzion Mountain.